The first step of a WordPress manual installation is to get the WordPress core files from WordPress.org, download them to your computer, so that you can then upload them using FTP to your web hosting account. To do that, go to WordPress.org slash download and click to download the latest version of WordPress. Once the download is complete, you should have a zipped file. When you unzip it, it'll create a folder called WordPress. Inside this folder is a whole bunch of files and folders with strange names and it doesn't matter that you don't know what any of them mean. Next, connect to your web hosting control panel through your FTP program and navigate in to your web root folder. For most people, this is called public underscore HTML or www, but it can vary. The next thing we're going to do is upload all of the files that we just downloaded. The only tricky part is getting them into the right spot. If the domain that you're using for your blog is dedicated to your blog, then the web root directory should be empty or pretty close to it. In that case, what we're going to do is open up this folder that we got and we're going to take all of the content, so I'm just hitting control A, and we're going to upload all of the content straight into the root directory of your web hosting server. However, if the domain you're using for your blog is already also being used for your website, let's say you have a flash-based portfolio website at your address, then you'll need to install your blog in a named subdirectory. Most people create a folder called blog so that their address will be something like myphotosite.com slash blog. If that's what you're doing, then before we upload, we're going to change the name of this folder to blog or whatever you want that name to be as part of your address and then upload the entire folder. So you see in this case I'm renaming the folder and uploading the entire folder as opposed to if my domain name is dedicated to my blog in that case I open up the folder and I grab the contents and move them in.